Okay, gang, we're going to deep dive into your heart. So, um, what does that mean? Um, well, I'm going to take you on a journey and we're going to go into your heart chakra and we're going to start to activate the different qualities of love. Now, love is an intricate construction of many virtues. Um, so, for example, love is wise and love is beautiful and love is passionate and love is courageous and love is generous and kind and wise and beautiful. And you know, the list of qualities that love generates goes on and on and on and so does the experiences that you can have from love. Um, so, in this uh, meditation, what we're going to do is I'm going to get you to connect to your heart center and from there we're going to just activate the different qualities. We're going to activate the innocence of your heart. We're going to activate the joy and the vitality of your heart. We're going to activate the passion and the romance and the sensuality that your heart can emit. And we're going to activate the deep wisdom and intelligence of your heart so that you can start to move in and through and live these dynamic qualities of love more and more in your life. Um, I do invite you to continue the deepening process in our free online course, which is Rebirth into Love, and you'll find the links at the end of this video. Um, and yeah, I'd love to hear the um, shifts that you have from it. So enjoy. I invite you to close your eyes, sit comfortably, feel centered in your heart, breathe gently and evenly. Now I want you to visualize that the sky is all around you and the ground is beneath you and there is a forest in front of you and I'd like you to take a walk through that forest. There are trees and bird sounds and as you walk you can feel the beautiful trees combing your aura with the leaves and as you walk through this forest you feel nourished and rejuvenated by earth energy in front of you is a beautiful lake filled with crystal water I'd like you to dive deep into that lake. Visualize yourself swimming naked through this beautiful crystal water. Swimming, swimming, swimming all the way to the bottom of the lake. And at the bottom you see a shell. It looks like a clam. And you take it. And you swim back up to the top of the water. You can see the sunlight filtering through the water, making your skin sparkle and shimmer as you swim to the surface. You get out of that lake and you open up the clam and there is a beautiful pearl in it. And you take that pearl and you place it in the center of your heart, the center of your chest. And that pearl activates your heart chakra. It activates the wisdom in your heart. The pearl spins and activates your goddess intelligence. So allow your benevolent knowledge to awaken in your heart. Allow your intuition and your emotional maturity to awaken in your heart. Allow yourself to have the wisdom to have solutions to all your problems.
Let that pearl spin and activate honesty and the ability to be upfront and direct, gentle, allowing and trusting, dependable. You are all these wise qualities. So feel that beautiful wisdom glowing its pearl-like essence through your heart. A beautiful yellow daisy grows up from the ground next to you and you pick it up, you look at it, its yellow colours shimmering and you place it into the centre of your heart chakra and as you do this you activate all those beautiful child-like wonders of your goddess heart. So let that beautiful yellow daisy activate your innocence, allow your purity to awaken, your playfulness, your curiosity, your wonder. And let that beautiful yellow daisy spin and awaken your beautiful goddess kindness. The ability to be tender and compassionate with yourself and others. So feel that beautiful joy awakening in your heart chakra as that yellow daisy spins. On the other side, you see a beautiful red rose appearing. You pick it and you look at this rose with its beautiful velvet petals. And you place that red rose in the center of your heart chakra. And you allow that red rose to activate the passion inside of you. Allow your sensuality to awaken. Allow the desire within you to, to, to fully bloom. The desire to be loved, to be touched, to be adored. Allow that red rose to activate all that longing inside your heart. The longing to be more, the longing to experience. So feel that beautiful red rose spinning and activating all your passion. You now look up into the sun and the sun is full of this fiery energy and you kind of reach your hand up and you pull this fiery energy of the sun into your heart. And your heart center starts to glow with this orangey, yellowy, reddy kind of energy. And this fire sunlight energy represents your warrior heart. So allow the warrior within to awaken in your heart, that beautiful loving warrior who is assertive and can be confronting, is knowing and powerful. Allow the wildness of the heart to awaken. The feeling of being unrestricted and free. Allow the beat that urges you to follow your intuition and experience life. Allow that beat to get stronger. Let that fire wake up your courage, your courageous heart. Feel that willingness to dare in life. 
to chase your dreams, to fearlessly identify and push through your limitations and be great. Feel that beautiful sun fire burning, awakening, activating the most powerful part of your heart to exist more. In the lake, you notice a beautiful pink lotus flower just floating gently in the water. And you walk to the lake and you pick up that beautiful pink lotus flower and it's dripping with all this beautiful sparkly water. And you place it into your heart chakra and it's got many petals. And this pink lotus flower spins and activates your goddess heart chakra and awakens your beauty to exist more, your true beauty. It allows your gentleness to awaken. The kindness, the ability to be tender and compassionate with yourself and others. This beautiful pink lotus flower spins and teaches you how to appreciate life, how to celebrate life. This beautiful pink lotus flower reminds you how to be elegant, how to have composure. This beautiful pink lotus flower encourages you to honor and adore and cherish yourself more and more and more. It teaches you self-love. And from the corner of your eye, you see on the ground this beautiful sparkling diamond and you pick it up and you look through it and you can see rainbow light shimmering through it and you take this beautiful crystal diamond and you place it into the center of your heart chakra and this diamond represents your intuition your ability to call upon higher guidance This diamond teaches you that you can call upon the universe at any time to support and guide you. This diamond teaches you and shows you about empowerment and teaches you how to have the confidence to be more yourself. That you can be confident and strong and tender and wise and passionate all at once. So let that beautiful diamond spin through your heart center. And you can feel the diamond spinning and the pink lotus flower of beauty spinning and the sunlight fire of the warrior burning through your heart and the passionate red rose and the playful yellow daisy and the wise pearl energy all swirling and activating your heart center. Let all those energies, all those qualities Merge and unite. Let them all exist as one frequency. 
Allow all these gifts. Allow all the gifts of the goddess to awaken within you. And as these gifts swirl and unite, a beautiful rainbow energy is created. And allow your heart center to swirl with this rainbow light of all of these amazing gifts. And when you're ready, you're going to shine this rainbow light out from your heart into the world. Knowing that you can be all of who you are. Knowing that the superpowers of the goddess's heart are available for you to use all the time.